Good morning, YouTube. What's going on? It's Mesa back at it with some Destiny. All right, tis Thursday, and he's located over here on the European Dead Zone. I want to fly into the Winding Cove? I'm flying in right now. Let's go see what he's got. So what you want to do is fly in over to the landing zone over there, and then walk up. There's a little cave right here, and then you make your way up to the top. So let's see what Uncle Zer has this week. What do you got, baby? All right, we have the Graviton Lance, we've got the young Ahamkara Spine from Destiny 1, Mask of the Quiet One, and Nezarek's Sin. All right, Graviton Lance, you probably already have this if you uh, completed the main campaign on three characters, so don't really have to spend much time on this one. I don't really use this thing at all, to be honest. Uh, maybe during the nightfall for Void, but... So you got Black Hole, third shot of a burst rips a hole through space-time, doing high damage and recall with no fall-off. The other main perk is Cosmology. Kills with this weapon cause enemy targets to detonate, but it's a really small explosion. Eh, they need to buff. Uh, they need to buff that, and also Dragonfly. Which uh, why can't they bring back Firefly? All right, Young Amkara Spine from Destiny One, but it's a little different in Destiny Two. Increases trip mine grenade duration and marks enemies damaged by this blast. Well, I'd say pass on these. Uh, Mask of the Quiet One. We got uh, this is pretty cool actually. Grants melee grenade and class ability energy when damaged. Uh, void ability kills grant health regeneration. Now, folks are saying that this works on all classes, meaning the top part, right? So the, uh, the more you get damaged, you'll get melee, grenade, and class ability, no matter what class you're on. But obviously, this is made for the Sentinel Titan, because it's void ability kills grant health regeneration. But I put it on my striker during a raid, and I was not seeing that uh, main perk proc. So I don't know. Let me know in the comment section. School me. All right, Nezarek Sin, I never use this on my Warlock. Void damage kills increased ability, energy, recharge rate. I'm usually going to go with Eye of Another World when it comes to my Warlock. So that's it for Uncle Zer, and hopefully with uh, Curse of Osiris, maybe, and well, remember, they're going to be making changes to the economy, changes to uh, the way we spend our legendary shards. I really hope he, I don't know, maybe he's... Maybe starts to bring some consumables or something. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section what you think Zer should sell. And no, I don't think we're ever going to get um, heavy ammo. Oh, sorry, not heavy. Power ammo syntheses. No, we're not going to get those. That's pretty much it, guys. So going to be light on the content this weekend. If you're uh, if you made it to the end, hashtag made it to the end, guys. I am loving. Call of Duty World War II, I've been playing it all freaking night, and uh, actually, I won't be playing it much this weekend, I have a whole bunch of errands to do. Um, I might upload maybe one video just reviewing it, but yeah, I'm not a COD channel, guys. It's just, it's mindless fun, man. I mean, these kids have so, like, the time to kill between Destiny and COD is, like, ridiculous. Like, everyone's camping, you feel like, like, all these little kids are hopped up on... Gamma Labs, G Fuel, whatever it is, because they just look at you and they know you're there and you're dead. Yeah, I definitely, I like Destiny PvP better, but yeah, Call of Duty World War II is just mindless fun. Boots on the ground, a lot of cool weapons, and uh, that's pretty much it, guys. So do me a favor, drop a like in this video only if you see fit. Follow me on the Twitter at MesaShawn. Check out my stream. Usually and always on YouTube, and that is it. I am out of here like Vladimir.